All right, thanks, Balint. Now, you ever finish a meal when your sweet tooth starts aching? It happens to me often, too. Well, that's the inspiration for One Local Bakery. And as you know, throughout the month of February, we're going to be highlighting black-owned businesses. And today, we're joined by Marcus Maxison, owner of Sweet Sundays. Good morning, Marcus, and morning. thanks for joining us. Good morning. Okay, now, Sweet Sundays. I know that doesn't mean you guys are just open on Sundays. No, no. What's the story behind the name? Um, the story behind the name, um, when I was a kid, after church, uh, we would come home, and my mom would cook dinner, and every Sunday we would have um, some type of dessert. Mm. So that would make the Sunday even sweeter. You know, going to bed, watching a movie, um, you'd have a sweet uh, dessert afterwards. So that was the motivation. The Lord actually gave me that um, name, uh, Sweet Sundays. I like so it. It has it's, a lot of meaning behind it. It's unique, and it yeah. has a beautiful story. Okay. So what all do you guys sell at Sweet Sundays? Um, well, our main attraction are our cheesecakes. Um, we do also provide um, pound cakes, cookies, mm. cupcakes. Um, yeah. A little bit of everything. Yeah. Now, I know this is a family-owned business. Right. So who does what? Who makes the recipes? Who does the mixing? Um, who does the baking? It's a family affair, but I, I tend to do the, the majority of the, of the, of the job. My, my wife and my kids, they help as well. Wow. So do you come up with every recipe yourself? or? Um, just basically checking on social media, what's hot, what's not. You know, um, right now, our number one seller is our, our strawberry cheesecake. I, mm, um, yeah. I bet you didn't know it was my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Strawberry cheesecake. Um, so we have about 20 flavors. Um, another, another popular one that we just uh, put out was our Biscoff, Lotus Biscoff. Mm. Yeah. Okay, nice. Now, is everything, um, is it made to order? Do you have yes. special orders or is it just what's on you guys' menu? Everything is fresh, freshly made to order. Um, okay. So what, whatever you order is freshly made. Wow. Now, I saw on your Facebook, everything looks extravagant. Okay. I mean, you could be on Cake Boss, <laughs> in a sense. So how does it feel to see your products sell the way that they do? Um, it, it feels good. It's a blessing to, you know, be able to be passionate about something and, and allow, you know, the Lord to bring it to fruition. Okay. Now, I noticed that your bakery is online. Yeah. So how does that work? How do people order? Do they pick it up from someplace, or is it delivered? We do all the delivery because we are an online bakery. Mm -hmm. um, so you can reach out to us on the social media platforms, Facebook, uh, uh, Instagram. Um, and like I said, basically, you place your order, and we um, make it fresh to order and deliver it. Wow. Now, where can they find you on social media? Um, on Facebook, uh, Sweet Sundays IL, and on Instagram, Sweet Sundays IL. And what's the orders of operation what time are you guys open since it's online you know people think online access is 24 <laughs> so when can they order and what's Tip the hours of operation typically they can order at any time but we're open between nine and five nine and five yep. well thank you so much for coming in and bringing my favorite dessert <laughs> you didn't know that but i mean the world works in mysterious right, ways right right? right 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 if you or anyone you know is interested in sweet sundays you can find them on social media at social media um sweet dash uh sundays dot square dot site and like i said our facebook uh sweet sundays il they have plenty of good desserts for you to try and satisfy your sweet tooth now if you or someone you know would like to join us on in the know just head to 25newsnow.com slash community and submit the form thank you so much for coming marcus appreciate it Stick